Despite polls consistently showing former Vice President Joe Biden leading Wisconsin, both campaigns still consider the state a battleground. The president is back again, just days removed from a rally in Waukesha. He's going to be in West Salem, which is near La Crosse, this afternoon. Stephanie Haynes gives us a look ahead. People are already lining up at the La Crosse Fairgrounds, ready for the president's visit. And if it's anything like his past two rallies in Wisconsin, we can expect thousands of people to arrive. Earlier this month, the president had planned a rally in La Crosse, but local officials asked him to cancel amid a surge of coronavirus cases in the area. The president did move it, but then tested positive for COVID-19. The La Crosse County Board Chair says she thinks this rally is irresponsible. Health officials say the county has seen more than 4,000 total cases since the start of the pandemic, and 21 people have died. His supporters at the rally say they're not worried about getting sick. Instead, they're excited to hear the president speak. I love that he loves America and that he is um, willing to stand up and protect the freedoms and the rights that we are so accustomed to, we take for granted really, and, and he's going to defend that. The president has drawn thousands of people to his rallies in Janesville and Waukesha. The campaign encourages people to wear masks, but not everyone does. In West Salem, Stephanie Haynes, TMJ4 News. Stephanie, thank you. Former Vice President Joe Biden's campaign released a statement ahead of the presidential visit, reading in part, quote, the Trump administration has admitted openly that they gave that they have given up trying to control this virus. And eight months into the pandemic, the president's failures have yielded devastating results.